The yo-yo effect continued against West Ham in the FA Cup quarterfinal last Sunday. What do I mean by the yo-yo effect? Well, up one minute and down the next to be precise, as has been the case for anyone who follows the club over the course of the past few seasons. But hope springs eternal thanks to Anthony Martial and his equaliser against the East London club. Each time United get closer to being ousted from a competition, the news seems to tighten around Louis van Gaal's neck. So from his perspective, it was a day to savour and that his team picked up a draw and a chance to continue in this competition, if only for one more game perhaps. The potential semi-final against Everton looms at Wembley later next month, which is the carrot that may be enough to get them across the line. Before that, there is a Premier League and Europa League fixture to consider, the first of which is trying to overcome Liverpool on Thursday night and reach the quarter-finals of the Europa League. Liverpool won the first leg 2-0 last week, and without an away goal for the Red Devils, it makes this task all the more tricky. Thursday is St. Patrick's Day, and with a large amount of Irish support for these two teams who wear predominantly red, it seems appropriate that it may be a green atmosphere at the Theatre of Dreams. Good news for United is that Jesse Lingard returned from suspension and could provide more spark than what was witnessed at Anfield. One thing is for certain, if David De Gea is subjected to as much work in this game as he was in the opening match, then it will be game over. The Spaniard was yet again outstanding despite his team losing 2-0. Truth be told, it could have been 5. Closing down Daniel Sturridge might be key with 5 goals against United in his last 7 matches against them in all competitions, leading one to believe that perhaps he enjoys playing against their great rivals. It's a tough game to pick as Manchester United will need to be caught of committing too many forward and risk conceding an away goal, but at the same time, they need to show intent, being two goals down, interesting times ahead. Don't forget you can get in touch, hashtag AskTolstonOnView, or directly on Twitter. Until next time, bye for now.